So in my hand here, I've got the details of the lineup for Renault's appearance at the Goodwood Festival of Speed, and they're going big. Renault has selected a show-stopping selection of electrified cars to wow the crowds at this year's sellout Goodwood Festival of Speed. For the first time in the UK, the Renault R5 Turbo 3E will showcase its motorsport credentials up the 1.16 mile hill throughout the four-day event. Uh, the Renault R5 Turbo 3E will be driven by Ivan Muller touring car legend of this parish. Uh, identified by its uh, wide flared carbon fibre bodywork, racing derived slick tyres and aggressive aerodynamics, the R5 Turbo 3E pays homage to the rally ready R5 Turbo 2, which turns 40 this year. Born to drift and using its two rear-mounted electric motors generating 380 horsepower and 700 newton meters of torque, it's likely the R5 Turbo 3E will leave an impression on the showgoers as well as plenty of rubber on the Duke of Richmond's famous driveway. Y yes, I suspect it probably will. Uh, for those who wish to get up close and personal with the brand's present and future, Renault's dedicated stand will play host to a selection of electrified cars. Most notably, the Renault 5 prototype will be on display ahead of the all-electric Renault 5's launch in 2024. Now, if you want to find out more info about the uh, Renault 5, uh, as soon as all that information comes out, I will be sure to post it on this channel. So make sure that you get subscribed and click the bell icon so you always get notified whenever new content goes up. Uh, so, uh, so it will be uh, electrified and made for modern drivers. The Renault 5 EV is built to have a new twist on the original, updating the iconic hatchback with a bold contemporary look and an advanced pure electric drivetrain. So hopefully more details of that will be coming out in the not too distant future. As well as that, it will be joined on the stand in another UK debut by the Renault Forever Trophy, a rugged adventure-ready take on the iconic Renault 4 that echoes the original's versatility and its suitability on both urban and rural roads alike. Likewise, that is going to be due uh, to be announced uh, next year, so we'll have all the details when that lands as well. Further demonstrating Renault's rich heritage, blended with a future twist, the stand will also play host to two exciting design concepts. The Renault 5 Dynamite uh, is French designer Pierre uh, Gonalon's resto mod interpretation of the classic Renault 5 hatchback with a fully electric drivetrain, frosted paintwork and gem-like headlights. I do apologise if, um, if I've butchered the name there. My French is... Uh, non-existent. Uh, so it will also be joined by the similarly electric Mute the Hot Rod, inspired by the record-setting hot rods of the 1940s and based on the 1924 Renault MT, whose striking form will take to the hill on Thursday the 13th of July before returning to Renault's static stand from Friday the 14th to Sunday the 16th of July. Returning to the present, the recently launched all-new Renault Austro E-Tech full hybrid, much like the one I have behind me here, will be available for visitors to see in the metal and experience for themselves uh, the generous cabin proportions, class-leading comfort and premium digital experience on the Renault stand. On sale now, the Renault E-Tech full hybrid uh, Austro will be uh, showcasing its sporty and uh, economic SUV credentials up the hill all weekend and if you click the link up here I will it will take you to our website where you can find out more details about how you can get involved and come and see the car for yourself in our showrooms. Meanwhile uh, at Goodwood's famed Electric Avenue display Renault has been invited to display the Megane E-Tech 100% electric. Now a regular feature of the event, this dedicated area acts as a showcase for the latest in electrified innovations and it's here that visitors can learn about the Megane E-Tech 100% Electric's 280 mile range and a choice of affordable ownership options. It will be driven uh, in front of the crowds on the Thursday too. The festival runs over four days from Thursday the 13th of July through to Sunday the 16th uh, and is set against the spectacular house uh, Goodwood House in West Sussex. Um, it's a fantastic event. I've been going now every year for, I think, 10 years now. I, I love going. It's, it's always a highlight in, in my calendar. 
and uh, and yeah so hopefully we'll be able to bring you updates from the event uh, while we're there so if you want to see more uh, when that lands as I say click subscribe click the bell icon I like this video too and let us know in the comments what are you looking forward to, to from this year's Goodwood till then I'm Max this is SMC Motor Group and I'll see you on the next one